Tonight, a North St. Louis County man is in jail accused of killing his own mother. Good evening, I'm Mike Bush. And I'm Ann Allred. The shooting happened yesterday morning on Edgewood Boulevard in Northwoods. Our Laura Barcheski talked with the neighbors who say this was not the first time they heard gunshots come from that home. Laura. It's not and neighbors tell me police had been out to the house several times in the past. They even saw 22 year old Tony Martin Jr. point his gun at family members before. Just sitting on the porch, a uh, nice cup of coffee was cool and you, you hear commotion, but you really don't take it in because it's not through a commotion and it's not happening to you. Um, shortly after that, I saw a uh, police everywhere and I just stayed on my porch. St. Louis County police say just before 11 Wednesday morning, Tony Martin Jr. was arguing while putting away groceries with his mom, Christy Martin, when she touched his arm to get him to turn around and he shot her in the chest, killing her. I didn't hear anything as far as like the shots, but then the aftermath, the whole street was blocked off, police and everybody was outside and the family was over here. So it was kind of real upsetting to her what had happened. Police say Christy was dead when they arrived at the house. Neighbor Glenn Williams says he stayed away from Martin because he was worried for his family's safety. It worried me a couple of times because he actually was outside. Nobody was out here. He's shooting in the sky. And then the one guy that lives where the umbrella is said that he pulled a gun on his grandmama. Williams says he has no idea how someone could do that to their mom. I wouldn't think that you would pull it on your mom. You know, somebody that's taking care of you, you staying in her house, so really it shouldn't have been an argument at all. Whatever she said should have just been the final word. Neighbor Lewis Brooks says he didn't know them well, but it's a very sad situation for the neighborhood. It's just a tragedy that that young man took a turn in the, in the worst. Uh, my heart goes out to the family. Tony Martin Jr. is charged with second degree murder and armed criminal action. He's being held on a $250,000 cash bond.